next thing is if we want to know the area of a segment so just a quick review this thing right here is called sector this thing right here is called just here is called arc length arc length well this thing right here right say we have an inter interior angle this right here is what we call segment so how are we going to find this area right here so let's just start with the very basic suppose we have a circle that has a two radius like this one radius radii 90 degrees and then we want to find this area since we already discussed how to find the area of a sector we can find it first area of the sector and then subtract the area of this triangle right and what will be left is now the area of this segment so how is that this is r this is r and this is 90 so the area of the uh, sector minus area of triangle triangle going to be area of going to be the area of the segment segment so now what is the area of the sector so, as you can see this is just 90 degrees we have the r and the radius so that will be 90 degrees over to 60 degrees times pi r squared and minus here we have the base and the height of the triangle as the same the area of the triangle is one half base our base is r and the height is r and so we have one half r times r or one half r squared and here we have one half pi r squared so if we if we uh, simplify this and factor out the common terms we have r squared over 2 pi minus 1 this is the area of this segment right here all right so we just find the area of the circle and then subtract the triangle now how about if we have a we have a circle and a segment or a sector that has an angle not equal to 90 degrees something like this one how are we going to find this segment right here well the first step is still find the area of the segment or the sector i'm sorry the sector this one so that's just theta over to 60 that's why r squared then again same idea subtract the area of the triangle that would be the area of the segment now the problem here is that we don't know what's the base and what's the height of this triangle we only know its angle so instead of using the formula one half bh we can use here the formula one half base times sine of the angle theta now in case you forgot this one half base sine theta formula you can always go back here on your triangle and still apply the principle of a triangle which is or the area of a triangle which is one half base times height so here you just have to draw a line perpendicular to one of the sides so i choose this side to have a line perpendicular to it and find this height in terms of this angle and this side so here this right here this side length here we have is equal to the radius so if we go back to our trigonometry sine of the angle right here we have a perpendicular so this is 90 degree angle so we have 90 degree triangle sine of this angle is the opposite h over the radius so we have h r sine theta plugging it back to the formula of triangle one half base this is our base our base here is also the radius this entire base one half so one half r our h is r sine theta and so now finally we have one half r squared sine theta that is how you find the area of this triangle all right so let's replace this the area of the triangle is one half r squared sine theta so again to find the area of this segment we have to calculate the area of the sector which is 
just the angle over 360 times the entire circle because that's because this area is just a fraction of a circle then minus the area of the triangle which is here which is not yet are uh, not given it is not given us a right triangle so we have to create or make a perpendicular line to one of its sides so i could also choose right here as my perpendicular side and this is now my height and this is now my base but for you to make it simple and you can view it nicely i choose the this side below this is the r we're in our r my base is r my hypotenuse is also r right so i i solve this h in terms of this angle and this right so we come up this one on half r squared so that. that's it for this video guys and in summary but i let me write that area of uh sector so the drawing is let me know that the drawing is like a pizza it's theta over 360 pi r squared for a uh, segment that's theta over 360 r squared minus area of triangle for length length of an arc is just the angle over 360 times pi or 2 pi r that's the circumference of the entire circle so this is it for this video guys and I hope you learned something and subscribe and talk to you in the next one. Peace out.